The 2021 annual St. Joe Trunk or Treat is coming up on Tuesday, October 26th, and will definitely be a fun time for everyone, especially the kids. St. Joe sports teams and clubs set up trunks in the St. Joe parking lot near the Fine Arts Building to hand out candy to kids ages 12 and under. It starts at 5 and ends at 6.30. There will be entertaining music from the St. Joe Band and beautiful singing from our choir to help keep you in the trunk or treating Jesus. spirit. Where our clubs and sports teams get together and they decide on a theme. Um, all of the members and players dress up and they get to have fun by passing out candy to all of our little ones that come. And it's just a great time to show that brew and spirit that we all have. Many of the students working the trunks use this as an opportunity to talk with friends and help with smiles on the younger kids' faces, which is always a good goal in the St. Joe community. It is a lot of fun to participate in and will definitely put you in the Halloween spirit. The planning, we've been like planning it at the student council meetings since like August. We've been planning for it and this year we're going to go back to how we used to do it. We're going to go over by the Fine Arts Building and we're going to block it off. And we're going to have all the people that are participating pull up their cars and we're going to decorate them. Today, another Halloween inspired idea has come up. Scary for Carrie, an event where students were allowed to pay $3 to dress up in fun Halloween costumes. All students were able to participate in the money raised goes to help Carrie Manscalco's medical bills. Carrie Manscalco is a St. Joe alumna who has been battling an unknown disease for many years now. And St. Joe wants to help out in any way we can. Both Trunk or Treat and Scary for Carrie have been huge hits among students for all ages, and I suspect this year will be no different. Reporting for BNN, I'm Zanaya Purvis. Go Bruins!